gentlemen, announcing the departure of Sam Piper Flight 20 to Martha's Vineyard in New Bedford. We request that passengers needing assistance or traveling with small children please board at this time. Faye. Yes, Jeff. First of all, that was a lovely announcement. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Um, but we don't have anyone on Flight 20, and there's not even anyone here. <laughs> I guess I'm just a creature of habit. It was 9 a.m. and I automatically announced flight 20. <laughs> it's kind of silly, isn't it? <laughs> it's all right. Attention, please. Flight 20 has been canceled. <laughs> I just uh, needed closure. <laughs> uh, Helen, what, what are you working on? I'm working on a new menu. Um, when I was in New York with Davis, he took me to this restaurant where everything was named after celebrities, so I thought it might be fun to try it with the people around here. I've got Helen's hash browns, <laughs> Sloppy Joe, hack it, <laughs> get it. <laughs> oh. Did you, uh, did you happen to name anything after me? I sure did. Huh? Antonio Spaghetti and Meatballs. How long did it take you to come up with that? <laughs> you, 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 just, you just look at the Italian guy and immediately think meatball? No, I, I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to offend you. Um, let's just forget about that, okay? Here, what can I get you for lunch? Mamma mia, I don't know. How about a nice pizza pie? Well, I don't know why Antonio is so upset. I think it's a lovely idea. Thank you. Are you going to name anything after me? I already did. <laughs> Faye's brand muffin. I'm a brand muffin? <laughs> Well, you know, you order one every morning. Wait, does the whole world have to know that? <laughs> Helen, what am I? What am I? What am I? Well, actually, Lowell, I, I, I really... I, I'm going to make I, the I, menu, right? I mean, you're not going to leave me out, are you? Oh, no. No, of course not. Um, as a matter of fact, you can be any food you want. Oh, okay. That's a big responsibility. I'm going to take a little time with this. You know, I mean, I, I have to be something that's low in cholesterol, and no fat, and I have to be easy to digest. I, mean, I, I don't want anybody waking up in the middle of the night saying, boy, that little mother gave me gas. I really enjoyed your helicopter tour. Uh, when it got a little choppy up there, I hope I didn't squeeze your hand too hard. Oh, no, no, no. I'm actually starting to get some feeling back into my fingers. <laughs> uh, listen, I'm going to be in Nantucket a couple of days. Uh, any chance you might be free for dinner? Hey, that's, that's really nice. But the uh, fact is, I'm, I'm seeing someone. Hey, baby. Hi. Hey. Oh, well, you can't blame a guy for trying. <laughs> Who's that all about? Oh, he just, he just asked me out. What do you mean he asked you out? Well, I said no. Yeah, but I, I'm not sure I like the idea of other guys asking you out. Of course, you know, if you want to go out with other guys, you can. I didn't say that. What, are you trying to get rid of me? Nah, I just want to give you your space. Well, I didn't ask you for space. Wait a minute. Is this your way of telling me that you want more space? No, I didn't say that. I don't want to go out with other women. Well, I don't want to go out with other guys. I'm perfectly happy with you. Well, I'm perfectly happy with you. I've never been happier in my whole life. Oh, well, I've never been happier either. Well, fine. Why don't we just see each other then? Okay. All right. <laughs> Wait a second. Hold it. Something important just happened here. <laughs> what was it? I think we just agreed to have an exclusive relationship. Right. Haven't we been doing that already? Yeah, but we made it official. Official? We're not engaged, are we? No, but that look of terror on your face is very flattering. Oh, come on. Well, I, I didn't mean it that way, you know. Why don't you take your foot out of your mouth so you can kiss me? All right. Hey, guys. I'm sorry to interrupt, but listen, 
Recently, I've been given the opportunity to become a food. So, I, I just want to run these ideas past you. Okay. Lowell Melt. Lowell Kebab. Or Lowell Slaw. Okay, good idea. You can get back to me later. Yeah, that sounds great. Hey, Joe, Joe, Joe. Something big just happened to me, man. Can you, can you hold on for just one second? What? Oh, okay. Alex and I uh, just took a very big step in our relationship. You got engaged? No, 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 no. no. I mean, nothing like that. We just uh, we uh, decided that we were going to only date each other. Oh, wasn't that what you've been doing? <laughs> yeah, kind of, but, uh, you know, we decided to make it official. Oh, great. So, what <laughs> Audrey, I'll uh, I'll see you tomorrow night, okay? Wait. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Bye bye. Audrey. Audrey. The redhead with the legs? No, the short, stumpy Audrey. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. I thought you were dating Cindy. Well, I am. Saturday. Oh, in case you're interested, Sunday. Yeah. I'm going out with Dana. <laughs> oh, wait, Cindy and Dana? Hey, no, don't forget Audrey. <laughs> but hey, you and Alex, man, that is great news. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, no, I'm real, I'm real happy about it. Yeah, well, I'm happy for you. Yeah, me too. Wait, you don't think that I'm moving too fast, do you? No, I just said I thought it was great. All right, yeah, I mean, I do too. I feel great about it. Well, you should. Well, I do. Don't I? Yeah, of course I do. <laughs> hey, I got to pick up this charter in Boston. Right. Well, yeah, fine. Pick up the charter. But listen, um, what you said earlier, uh, I'm doing a good thing, right? Absolutely. Okay, because I'm, I'm real happy about me and Alex. Good. Because okay. I'm real happy about me, Cindy, Audrey, Dana, and Michelle. <laughs> There's a Michelle. Oh, didn't I mention her? Oh, yeah. Sunday brunch. So, um, Alex is outside, right? Because I want to congratulate her. Yeah. Stay away from her. She's all I got. Helen, uh, I hear you're uh, naming items on your menu after people who work around here. Right. <laughs> what am I? <laughs> Oh, you're the jumbo turkey leg. Is that some kind of crack? Well, it's because you order it practically every day. I don't want to be that. All right, Roy, fine. What do you want to be? A salad. Have you ever seen a salad? You fine... You are a salad. Okay, what do you want for lunch? The Roy salad. <laughs> and, and, and the jumbo turkey leg. Hey, Brian. I heard about you and Alex making it official. You got engaged. No, 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 no. We're just, uh, just dating exclusively now. Well, congratulations. I think that's great. You made a really good decision. Thank you. I did. Didn't I? Well, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to name something on my menu after you, too. How about the Alex and Brian soup and sandwich combo? I'm a salad. <laughs> combo. I mean, the, 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 the sandwich and the soup don't always have to be together, right? I mean, sometimes the sandwich might want to be by itself. Is that so bad? I mean, I could spend some time with the chips, or maybe just, uh, it's off hours with the pickle. I mean, what does a sandwich always have to be with the soup? It doesn't, does it? Brian, are you having doubts about this Alex you, thing? What, no, where would you get that from? I mean, when two people feel for each other the way Alex and I feel for each other. How are you doing? I mean, you know, when there's, when there's trust, and when there's, there's love, and there's, there's trust. Great deal of trust there. There's, uh... What? 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 Where was I? Same place as me, in a steaming shower, soaping up that blonde chick. Uh... Hey, Brian, remember, you have a great relationship with Alex. Uh, you're right. You're right. I've got a great woman. I am not missing a thing. What is? Hey, Joey, 
are these women? Fashion models. That was the charter I picked up. Can you believe it? What? <laughs> right this way, ladies. Th this is a test, right? You look like you've been sucking on a squid. <laughs> hey, plane was a good idea, Hackett. Cigarette? Uh, no, thanks. I don't smoke. Don't lecture me. <laughs> Marjean, Marjean, you look like you're posing. Come on now, I want you to look natural. You know, like you normally do when you're hugging a propeller. Yeah. <laughs> you know, back when I was a model, I wouldn't have taken a crap job like this. You were a model? Is that so hard to believe? No, no, no. I mean, that's what I would have guessed. You know, model, stewardess, longshoreman. All right, good, good, good. Everybody off. Let's see. Uh, you stay. Everybody else move. Tiffany, come here. I want you to grab this wrench and uh, screw around here with the plane. Make like you're fixing the propeller. Oh, yes. That's cute. That's cute. Hey, 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 Joe. How come I never consulted when a new mechanic's hired? No, no, no. no. Well, look, you don't understand. Oh, uh, I understand perfectly. Doesn't take a genius to figure out how this one got the job. <laughs> hey, uh, Joey, I need to see you for just a... Hack it, hack it. Can we do something about the people here? We're working. Uh, no, it's all right. He's okay. Uh, everybody, everyone, this is my brother, Brian. Hey, <laughs> listen... Before this gets out of hand, uh, I, I, I think you should know that uh, I'm in a I'm in a committed relationship. So sorry. <laughs> Look, you're cute. Nobody cares. Take it outside. Look, uh, Brian, do you want to see me about something? Yeah, uh, I need to do uh, to sign this. It's a clipboard. You want me to sign a clipboard? Well, not if you're gonna cop an attitude. You couldn't resist, could you? They're, they're amazing, aren't they? Well, they're that, amazing. Yeah, you know, they're okay. I mean, if you go for that type. But I, I just got to tell you that uh, none of them, none of them are as beautiful as Alex. <laughs> ah! What, what? What happened to you? Uh, I was working on the helicopter engine. The damn oil line broke. Well, go, go, go clean up or something. <laughs> I just came over to tell you that I was thinking about our talk this morning and... I feel just great about it. Yeah, yeah, me too. Feel great. Never better. <laughs> Go clean up. All right. Helen? Yeah? Finally decided what I'd like to be on the menu. Oh, actually, Lowell... First of all, I feel very honored that you would even think to include me. You're welcome. It's just that... It's quite a tribute not... to have something yeah. named after you. Kind of like the Washington Monument, or the Lincoln Memorial, or the Flintstone Vitamin. <laughs> so, it's with no small amount of pride that I can say to you... Stop it, Lowell. I decided not to name anything after anybody. Uh, no big deal. <laughs> Guys, you, you, you see Joe carrying on out there. He's, he's, he's acting like a little kid. Well, he's just excited because they're gorgeous models. Oh, come on. They, they're not even that good looking, really, when you take away the, the hairdos and all the makeup and the perfect bodies. I mean, what do you have? The woman I went out with last night. <laughs> Hackett, you are as transparent as glass. You shackled yourself to Lambert, now it's killing you. No. He didn't shackle himself to anyone. He made a very mature decision based on love and caring, and he couldn't be happier. What she said. Uh, it is not natural for a guy to look at the same woman for the rest of his life. Well, or, or in your case, until you run out of quarters. <laughs> Brian knows exactly what he's doing, don't you, Brian? Brian, 
Defend yourself here. Oh, he can't. He can't. He's too busy staring at that babe over there on the phone. Oh, come on. I mean, listen, even though, yes, I'm in a committed relationship, but that doesn't mean I can't look at a beautiful woman. I'm a guy. <laughs> Well, uh, I, I don't, uh, I don't understand what all the fuss is about. In Italy, men aren't even expected to be monogamous. Of course not. They just keep going from dame to dame, trying to find one who shaves her pits. <laughs> I resent that comment, Roy. Don't deny it. Just resent it. <laughs> Ellen, can I get some ice water? Oh man. It's amazing how hard those girls work under those hot lights. What do you mean, uh, the girls are like all, all sweaty? Well, you're not interested in them, Brian. No, I'm not interested in them. You're in a committed relationship with Alex. I'm in a committed relationship with Alex. You couldn't be happier. You couldn't be happy. That's very good, Helen. I couldn't even see your lips move. Oh, and listen, by the way, um, turns out this is the girls' last day of shooting, yeah. so I thought I'd invite them to our house tonight for a little party to celebrate. Party? Couldn't care less. I couldn't care less. I, I've done the party thing. I don't need to do the party thing anymore. You know, wild, crazy, uninhibited fun, right? Meaningless sex, uh, hot, freaky. I don't have to do that anymore. Hey, Joe, we need directions to the party tonight. Oh, excuse me. Gee, I don't have to do that anymore. And you know why I don't? Because of this, this lady right here. Yeah, so you guys, you go have your party, okay? Party all night long. Don't even wait up for me. Because I know exactly where I'm going to be. At home, having a quiet evening with Alex. Not tonight. I'm going to Boston. Tonight? You remember, I'm going to see my college roommate. I think you'll be okay without me for one night. Tonight? After all these months of traveling, Paris, Milan, Rome, it's nice to let your hair down with some normal people. Hey, John, this is a really classy party, and this cheese in a can stuff is really great. <laughs> oh, hey, uh, bye, you need an ashtray? Don't lecture me. Hey, you really want to do something for me? You'll dance with me, Sparky. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I better get that. Hi. 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 Hey, 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 wait a minute. Hey, I could wait just a minute. Roy, what are you doing? Oh, look, Hackett, I know I wasn't invited. <laughs> <laughs> look at all those models. Please, Hackett, you gotta let me stay. There must be one of them you can spare. All right, Roy, you can stay. <laughs> As a matter of fact, uh, I think I've got the perfect girl. <laughs> Bye. 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 There's someone over here I want you to meet. A man who looks like he's been around the track a few times. You stay right here, stud muffin. I'm gonna go get us a couple of drinks. Hack it. She's rude and crude and looks like she could hurt me. Thanks, I owe you. <laughs> I like Italian men. I think you're all so charming. Uh, oh, well. And you, you are uh, una bella ragazza. That means a beautiful girl. Oh, what do you call a beautiful boy? In my village, we call him Bibi. <laughs> oh, oh, God! Oh! Wow, I'm sorry. Uh, can oh. I help? Oh, it's okay. Uh, is there some place I can get cleaned up? Yeah, here, come, come with me. Right through this door, there's a couple of bathrooms upstairs. Oh, thanks. Sure. <laughs> I see you at the airport, you're uh... in a committed relationship. Do you excuse me, please? <laughs> committed. <laughs> oh hey, Brian, how you doing? Where you been? Ah, uh, been doing everything I could to stay away from this place. <laughs> Got so desperate that I ended up at the library. <laughs> the library? Yeah, big mistake. I still have a book overdue since junior high. 
Apparently, I owe over $700 on our bodies ourselves. Oh, I'm not available, please. Uh, don't flatter yourself. Hey, Brian, 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 hey, sh 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 come on, stop being so jumpy. Why don't you just relax, join the party. You, know, you don't have to do anything. You're right, you're right, you're right. I'm a mature adult. I mean, so what? There are beautiful women all over the place. I can handle it. I cannot handle it. Excuse me, is there any more ice in the kitchen? Well, what is it with you women? Don't you know when a man says no, he means no. So, can we please need a little more? You can't just wait one no, second. No, you can't wait. You can't wait. Come on. Do you mind if I use your phone? No, they're all over me. <laughs> okay, all right, Brian. What is so damn important? I'm in a committed relationship. Yeah, well, I'm not, so could you make this quick? <laughs> this key? Okay. Lock the door and do not let me out until the morning, no matter what happens. What, you're kidding me. Hey, you see those women down there, Joey, and you know me. I don't believe this. So listen, 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 I'm trying to be good here. You gotta help me out, all right? So no matter how much screaming or begging I do, don't let me out of this room. You're serious? Absolutely. All right. Joe, let me out now. You don't understand. I just came up here to... Please don't come any further. 